Here's a thought. We have this one too somewhere. I lost it. Okay, guys, we're here. That's why it's red. Um, and I don't find any more teachings like his. Although I think, you know, they probably do exist, but I don't find any. But, I, you know, uh, the message was, what spirit are you of? And, you know, he said something about, you know, certain occults practicing um, phallus and sun worship. And, um, you know, that's, one, that's how they're creeping in your houses, through the phallus. Right? And, uh... Also, then I thought about a scripture where it says, going down to Egypt will be your shame. Going down unto Egypt will be your shame. And I realized, like, that's how I became cursed. And Egypt are those, uh, those, those uh, occult, occultics that practice phallus worship and, you know, uh, stolen knowledge from Egypt and uh, all of those things and um, you know it, it really has it has I'm not a part of any occult um, or mystery school you know um, I don't think they're all bad I don't think they're bad but there are some I'd rather not you know uh, mess with you know what I mean like they're the the, uh, uh, you know, those type of things, and, you know, that's, 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 that's a problem, that is a problem, you know, so, a lot of us were, uh, you know, our life is in the condition that it's in, um, going down to Egypt will be your shame, you know, they don't really, um, teach you too much, but they just utilize you, you know, as a tool and, you know, to practice spiritual abuse on, and, um, and don't even care, so I don't remember the name of that scripture, but that is definitely a scripture that was brought to mind while I'm sitting here. I just woke up, I kind of been sleeping all day, not in really a decent mood, I just can't wait to get out of here, I <sighs> just can't wait to get out of here, um, like my dreams are re repetitive, I've always seen the street, so this reminds me of some a past life, like me living on the same street somehow, and uh, doing the same things and looking at the same stores and things and it's all the same blah. It's all blah. That's the word for it, blah. You know, in the dream it looks more boring and in real life it's still boring but it looks more boring in the dream. You know, so I'm bored out of my mind always always you know so and i don't think i've ever been bold enough to make um that change to really go after the things that i want passionately and it's usually because fear has was placed in my life or you know just obstacles like extreme obstacles that will make you you know like exhausted fighting them trying to remove them and, you know, I just wonder, like, why, why am I going through all of these, you know? And I realized it's definitely because of those that don't have a soul and are looking for purpose, etc., and are looking for energy. And that's why I've been having a hard time and, and all of these occults and things, and I'm not a part of it, and they feeding off of you, and it's just, it's horrible. And I don't think that I was meant to have this type of uh, life experience. You know, this is misery. And I realize those that are not of this spirit, I 
aren't even going through all of those things. They're only bothering those with a with a nice spirit. And with a cert with a certain spirit. And if you have a beautiful spirit, they're attacking you to beat you up because they don't like how you shine. So at an early age in life, I was cursed by a high priestess witch. All right, who was also bothering my daughter at this point. Um, this is the same witch bitch. Yeah, it's getting on my nerves. It reminds me of the story Maleficent, just saying how pretty and beautiful she was. And she hating her, you know, because she didn't have it. And she hated everything more prettier than her. Mirror, mirror on the wall, all the fairies of them all. She hated it. So she would curse people um, to afflict them, to make them age faster, to, you know, stop their uh, evolution, hinder their ability to perceive things. You know, this is the high priestess bitch with a beat. 